Hey everybody, it's me, Super Paul Games. Welcome back to Ghost Control Incorporated. We're just sitting around the HQ talking about things that ghost controllers do, like, hey, do you like ladies with boobies? Christian's like, I love ladies with boobies. Carl's like, oh yeah, boobies are nice. <laughs> All the kind of things you do where you got nothing to do. Apparently they're all mad at each other though, because they're all in separate rooms. Somebody either made a mess or they really missed the toilet. Oh! Hello, this is Bumblebee, the developers of the game. Okay, I'm gonna take the call. Do you want to win the game now? What? Okay, win the game immediately? Okay, now we know you're a cheater type. <laughs> what? No! What? No! Did we get fucked over? Please tell me that's not... Uh, that's funny whoever developed the game, now I'm scared. Hopefully they didn't make the game harder. I'm gonna be all scared the rest of the game. I'm gonna be like, did I fuck everything up? You know what, boys? This is Dr. Steve Hillman. I'm getting sick about sitting around here. Let's go find some action. Some ghost action. Apparently everybody else is waiting too. Oh, there they go. <clears throat> Can we go wherever we want? Boo, boo. Oh shit! Uh, this is Ghost Control Home with the eco-friendly dis inspection. We don't offer discounts, but we do offer help. Two trains are moving backwards. All right, uh, we're we're on our way. We're gonna go save the underground. See you, ghost be gone. Meow, meow. Oh, I can't do the Ecto-1 alarm thing. I feel shame. Let's commit Sapleku. I have failed you all. All right, we got Vibromatic ready. Everybody is ready to go. Anyone home? Okay, I see a slide. Holy shit, his energy 63? I don't think we've fought anybody like that before. Um. Dr. Steve, you probably have to move to let other people uh, go. Okay, that specter's pretty weak, but that big slime ball's a problem. Suck it, slime ball. All right, uh, Carl, take a position. And just fucking miss. <clears throat> Fail us all. Form the flying V. The mighty ducks taught us the way. <laughs> go away, slime ball. Yeah, he just he just ghost jizzed on us. All right, Dr. Steve, why don't you blast the specter? And then you're gonna have to pull back so we can hit the slime ball. Christian, blast the slime ball. Carl, can you drop your trap on that ghost? <coughs> Sorry about that. Okay, it should get him. Ah! Oh, yep, it did. It pulled it back. All right, I think there were three ghosts. Dr. Steve, fuck it up. All right, Carl, stop this man. This is why you wear jumpsuits, because when a ghost is going to ecto-jizz all over you, you don't want to go home and with that all over you. It'll be in your hair probably still, but that's why it's good to be bald like me. That's why Dr. Steve is probably like, you know what, I'm the veteran guy. I'm going to just sit in the back and not get ghost jizzed on. I'll hit you on the head. Ah. Uh, Poor Christian, he's slimed and cursed. All right, Dr. Steve, keep blasting this dude. I wonder if we need a better sensor to see what his special abilities are. All right, Christian. No, Carl, get this guy. Mine is the last voice you'll ever hear. Can't wait for more packs and stuff to come out. Well, he missed, but at least he's not gonna damage too much like that. Oh man, he's when he gets done, he's gonna be like, dudes, why did I have to take all the ghost jizz? Come on. Well, Dr. Steve is hiding back here. And, uh, who's that? Carl's over here? Alright, Christian. Uh, drop a trap right on this guy. And while you're at it, Carl, pick up the good trap. And, uh, oh, I forgot what room I saw the explosions coming from. Good deal. Carl, pick up the trap. Oh, there's the ghost right there. You know what? Carl, you could probably drop the trap. Oh, damn it. I guess we'll just blast this guy. He's pretty weak anyway. Mine is the last voice you'll ever hear. 
Steve, can you uh, throw your Pokeball at him? Kids, don't try this at home. Yeah. Can we leave already? Well, that wasn't a lot of money, but at least it was a pretty safe gig. Drop those ghosts off. Man, I love that Pokeball, though. That's very versatile. Uh, yes? Hello, am I talking to Ghost Control? I think my kennel's behaving strangely. Uh, give us ten minutes. We gotta go drop off some Jizzy Ghosts. DJ Jizzy Ghost, and then we'll be on our way. Alright, let's roll. Let's get there before the other guys do. I want there to be a big... There should be a big ghost trap we can put in our, uh, car. Alright, let's give you the Vibromatic. Everybody else should be okay, because we emptied out everything. This door was open. I expect us to be expected. Alright, Christian, get a reading. Four ghosts? Alright. I am scared. Oh, that's like a 37 with a Rattler. And a four. Oh, he's not that powerful. That's not a big deal. Dr. Steve, can you hit either of them? Nice start. Carl. All right, I don't know if you can get an angle from there. Apparently not. <clears throat> At least you tried. Holy shit. They're everywhere. All right, Christian, let's just bring it right to him. Oh, you, you don't have a trap ready. Let's drop your trap uh, right on him. You don't have enough tr points? Oh, fuck it, just blast him. Here you have it, the power of love. I will roast that ghost. Hey, we're doing pretty good. We're taking him down fast. Let's bring in the firewire. And we haven't damaged too much stuff yet. This might be famous last words, but... Oh, whatever, that freaking alien thing. <laughs> no! Christian! Damn it, you twat. Alright, Carl, you go drop the good trap right there. Um. Ah, oh, shit. Blast this guy. That way, if he gets near the good trap, it'll catch him. Dr. Steve, hit that guy. And try and hit the... The feeble apparition who's got a 38 energy. Oh. Christian's freaking out. I think he's gonna run away. There he goes. Did I drop a trap? Where's the trap? Did I forget to drop it? Oh shit. That's fantastic. <laughs> All right, Dr. Steve, can you hit that ghost? No, you're gonna have to move to here or something. Good luck, Carl. You're getting a gangbang all around you. Well, that trap failed mightily. Come on, Dr. Steve, we gotta fuck this guy up. Don't get mad. Get even. One for me. Two for you. Oh man, Carl, just hold on like one turn. Oh, no, Carl, that's not holding on. Now we have a big problem. No, Dr. Steve, you had to hit him twice. Oh shit, you're gonna get cornered and gang banged by that ghost. We got one of them. Alright, Dr. Steve, run, because you gotta get some distance from this thing before you can uh, hit it. Oh, the trap did it. Get it. Shit, fuck. <laughs> she was like, I'm just running into the house. Damn it. <clears throat> Alright, Dr. Steve, um, is this far enough away to hit it? You're toasted. Excellent. Man, these guys are pretty weak. If I could get some traps laid down, how many traps does he have? Okay, he's got a few traps. Quit trying to scare my dude! Yeah, we got one of them because of a trap that was in there. How damaged is that guy? Okay, he's the only ghost that's not been hit yet. Okay, let's... Oh, no. I want this... Oh, shit. 
Okay, we're gonna switch to this trap and lay it right here. Oh, fuck. Just don't get scared away, Dr. Steve. Okay, step in here. Step in here. <laughs> you hit any of these guys? Oh, fuck, you can't. That's not good. Just put you on guard. Got one of them or both of them, I'm not sure. Alright, Dr. Steve, why don't you... Fuck. Oh, man. Put you on guard and see what happens in a second. <clears throat> we don't have a reader, so I can't tell exactly how many people are in here or ghosts. All right, Dr. Steve. Why can't you move, man? Dr. Steve? What's going on, dude? Okay, there we go. Whoa, he's like right next to you. He teleported. He hit him? Yeah! Don't scream at me. Alright, Dr. Steve, try and lead him over that trap. Actually, throw your Pokeball at him. Oh, he teleported right there. Fuck. Run. <laughs> uh, do we have any other traps? Yeah, let's put that there. Is he gonna reappear? Let's see, let's drop the other trap, like, right there. <clears throat> see if he comes up to try and get us. Now we're protected on two of the sides. All right, Dr. Steve, why don't you pick up this trap? And trap it right there to see what the ghost does. Ghost? Alright, we gotta go find that ghost. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Is he in here? Oh, the trap got him. He ran over it. Hell yeah. I am alive and they are dead. No! Dead, dead. Damn it, Carl went to the sanatorium. <laughs> Damn it, Carl. Oh, we can't take this call. We gotta go to back to HQ, dump this off, pick up a new guy, get some mental health. Dang it, Carl. They're gonna be like, what happened to the last person? You don't want to know. Uh, I think strength 52 would be good. Wait, what do we got? <clears throat> Christian's the leader. Are you a scientist? Yeah, we'll take a scient- Oh wait, no, our strength's not very good. We'll take this lady. What's her name? Meredith Price. So let's put her here. You get all this junk. You even get to wear the dude's old suit. Unisex, apparently. We had some mental health. Oops, I should have sold our ectoplasm. Whatever. Man, Dr. Steve saved the day, though. He was able to pull victory out of the jaws of defeat. Unfortunately... Oh, man, that's a lot of mental health costs. I, would th I thought it would be a lot cheaper, because we only had, like, two people to get fixed up. Sexy ghosts, wearing their sexy thongs, sexy thongs. All right, let's, uh, uh, hello, ghost control. I'm calling from the cemetery. I saw Reddy's letting Tombstone disappear. That's not the way it should be. We'll be there in a minute. Oh, man, exterminators, please don't go there. Please don't go there. Cemeteries are what we're best at. Dr. Steve, like, when there's a mo down moment, 
at the uh, headquarters, he can be like, I can tell you about all the people I used to work with that went crazy. There's this guy who founded this EGOD, and then we had a uh, other guy who went nuts, Nutty John McGee. I forget who it was. All right, I, I think that's good to go. Is it midnight yet? All right, Christian, let's get a reading. The senses make no sense. Six ghosts. Oh, shits. Uh, won't we put a trap in your hand? This should be a. Is that the lady? It's hard to tell. I think that's long hair. Put her on guard, and we'll put Dr. Steve on guard. Alright, Christian, you got your trap ready. Let's, uh, advance forward and see what we can find. There's gotta be a ghost right up in here. Okay. Feeble apparition is pretty powerful, and a specter who's pretty weak. <clears throat> Alright, Meredith, can we get you up here? Hey, good shot. What's her aim? That's what I should have been looking at when I hired somebody. Oh, her aim's actually pretty good. That's something I should have paid a lot of attention to before. Damn it, Dr. Steve. Just because you were the hero last time doesn't mean you can destroy the cemetery. I can recognize a problem when I see it. That feeble apparition's a pretty big problem right now. All right, Meredith, get some uh, distance from it. No, yeah, get some distance from it. Let's do this as if we were professionals. Hey, we finally got a woman in the group. Uh, Christian's like, I was the woman, shut up. <laughs> uh, can you hit that guy? Okay, that didn't work quite as well as I hoped. I think we're making a mistake of splitting the party, but, oh you. shit. It's getting an energy at 45. Oh no. Look out, Meredith! Oh, shit. Who are you to think you can scare us? Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> Alright, hey, Meredith, drop a trap right behind you. Oh, shit, you had him fucking missed, didn't you? Come on, Steve, if you could hit. Okay, that's one good move. Okay, Christian. Shit, you're stunned or something because of the ghost. That's really bad. He's gonna run off before he can do anything. Damn it! Damn it, Christian, no! No, Christian. Bad Christian. Okay, Meredith, you're gonna have to fucking run. Let's see, two, nine. You get another trap out? Some kind of a long shot. Can you drop it under? Oh, shit. Can't drop it under that ghost. Damn, damn, damn. All right, Dr. Steve, pull back. Blast that ghoul. God save the bean. This is not going to be good. Leave us alone, ghosties! Smoke is in your eyes. So oh, she's gonna get gang banged by all the ghosts. That's not a fun party. <laughs> Christian, pull your shit together! Damn you, Christian. Alright, Meredith, drop on a trap. Okay, um, hit that guy. I'll teach you a lesson! Dr. Steve, we gotta hit that big guy like twice. Okay, that's a start. Man, there's still too many of these guys that are powerful. Ah! No, Meredith! Damn it. Damn you. <laughs> no, Dr. Steve, you had to hit him twice. Son of a tit. No, don't shoot the lady coming at you. He's like, ooh, boobies are running. Fuck. Ah! Here is Tesla when you need him most. Well, we Smoke are Smoke is in your eyes. You know what, Dr. Steve? I hate to say it. Oh no, Meredith, I think he's gone mental. <laughs> you know what, Dr. Steve? Run. Oh, there goes another one. She was like our new hire. She just got hired. She didn't last like one day. 
Alright, let's, uh, I don't know if we even have some ghosts. Let's go home in shame, Christian. Christian, you abandoned us! Motherfucker. I shouldn't have separated everybody like that, admittedly. Christian just was, like, gone. Now we gotta hire someone new. Alright, get our sanity restored. Down to Dr. Steve and Christian again. Dr. Steve, you survived so much. Um, <clears throat> let's see. We need someone with a... Uh... Here, let's pause this a second. How much strength do they need to wield that? 45. I liked having a lady on the team, but this one's too weak. Angry flirt doesn't sound good. Plus, we need someone stronger. Holy shit, this person is strong and has a lot of constitution. A bruiser. <clears throat> Not very sane, though. We need somebody with a lot of sanity points. Well, oh, fuck it, we'll hire this person. Yeah, we've hired five different hunters. I don't know if we should be proud of that. That's because of all the people who left. Well, that looks like Dr. Steve's little brother. <laughs> or cousin, maybe. Hey, Cousin Steve, thanks for this rad job! Cousin Steve neglects to tell him how many people went crazy with his job. <laughs> Christian's like, should we tell him? Dr. Steve's like, no. <laughs> Alright, let's put your Vibromatic in your hand. Wow, that was... Man. That was a lot of ghosts. I think it's gonna be the end of this episode. Next time, we'll find some more ghosts and hopefully keep getting better. That was a little bit of a disaster. Poor, <clears throat> poor Meredith, or whatever her name was. She was short-lived. I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.